Welcome to another episode of Carpet Cleaning Guys Vlogs. And in today's video, I've got my wife helping out. She's doing some pre-vacuuming. You can see we got some spots, some soil, some debris, all kinds of stuff going on. A little bit of pet urine in a couple of the rooms. I'm not going to show the whole house, just a couple of areas that we're doing. And this carpet, actually, you'll see as we go along, that right there is actually um, pilling. And it's pilling from the, the uh, teenage boy uses this room, and he wears black cotton socks. And this is the all-white nylon carpet. And by sitting at that desk and moving around this room, a lot of tiny black fibers from the socks have actually adhered to the carpets and you got what's called pilling which is similar to what I was showing you on uh, the cotton pads when you clean sometimes they'll get a pilling and you have to pull that off but my wife um, had a tool in her vehicle she took a separate vehicle and met me here and that tool is to I guess pull the dog hair off of the uh, back area of the SUV and it actually, I'll show it to you here in a little bit, it actually worked really good at taking the pilling off the carpeting. So you'll see that. I didn't realize it while I was doing this, I kept going over and over it, I thought it was soil and then we later realized that that's what it was from the black socks look at that orbit vibe that thing is incredible i did use um, the swirly this morning this is my afternoon job actually this is my one o'clock and i was getting a little bit behind schedule so i did give my wife a call she volunteered to come out and give me a hand this particular house is about five thousand square foot it is going on the market, or it is on the market, I should say. It should sell fairly quickly. It is right on the golf course, right on the green. And this one is in a town called Port Orchard. So there you go. Cleaning up this particular room, and then I'll head over to the second room, here I'm using the Glad Pad, which is an all flat cotton pad. And for this room, I'm going to use, <clears throat> excuse me, the all microfiber pad. But wait, wait for it. Who's visiting your boy? <laughs> oh, yeah, Russell Wilson. Come on, Wilson. I think it's his birthday. He just turned 33. Seahawks, look at this room. We got Seahawks paraphernalia everywhere. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Even the bathroom has Seahawks stuff, Seahawks uh, curtain or shower curtain. <clears throat> and I mentioned to the homeowner, I said, boy, your wife needs to talk to my wife. Oh, let me show you this. Along this little um, step, what I like to do is just take a clean cloth, I've already pre-sprayed it, and then get that bull nose and get the little face plate, almost like stairs. You know, I don't have to use the auric orbiter on it. But anyway, back to the story. I told the lady of the house here, I said, you need to have a talk with my wife and uh, let her know about all this Seahawks gear because my wife won't let me put up any Seahawks gear because she's a 49ers fan. <laughs> and lo and behold, they said this upstairs belongs to their son. He's a Seahawks fan, but if you go down into the lower level, the basement, it's all Seahawks gear. I mean, 49ers gear. They're 49ers fans. You can believe that. Oh, this I wanted to show... This is a tight area along the side of the bed. And you could see I stood the handle straight up. Move the Orbot Vibe right into place. It is orbiting and cleaning. 
doing a fantastic job and with two hands I'll come back through here and get along that edge a little bit better but for demonstration purposes I did want to show you how easy it is to do that and then of course the triangle brush which is a standard soft bristle deck brush a lot of people ask me about that I like to groom with the soft bristle deck brush it allows me to pull the fibers both directions so I can see if I missed any spots as well as <clears throat> makes those beautiful triangles and look on my feet oh yeah <laughs> I did go back to my shoe booties I ordered a hundred I think it's 50 pairs for like seven dollars on Amazon and I was practicing how to put these on easier rather than sitting down and I find that when you walk in the door if you just lean against the wall or lean against the door you can lean against the wall pull your foot up slide it on lean against the other direction pull your foot up and slide them on so you'll probably see me wearing these shoe booties quite often I still have the white crocs the only problem with the crocs is when you're doing three or four jobs a day and they have those holes in them they're breathers and it ends up letting the uh, green dragon or the solution go through the shoe get your feet kind of wet or your socks kind of wet and by the end of the day uh, that's not good you can get really bad toe fungus if you're not careful so and I didn't get a, a bad fungus or anything but I did notice that uh, my feet that my toes were wet look at that beautimous triangles that's right that's my new word beautimous absolutely beautimous look at those shoe booties come on <laughs> I look like a a little cleaning elf although I kept stepping on that left uh, tab there in the back and peeling it off and having to put it on and actually this job I am using the uh, awesome end cap and I used it at four ounces per gallon so I put 16 ounces in my four gallon sprayer and I also have some magic bullet in the spray bottle for spotting Look, another beautimous room. Oh, yeah. These clients were extremely happy. Now, here's that that dog uh, brush that my, my wife was using. It's basically taking off all this pilling. And I, this could be the very first time these carpets have been cleaned because I did notice on the stairs and you'll see a little bit of shedding. And so this particular tool is actually made for carpet. So we're not using a cheese grater and tearing up someone's carpet. <laughs> I think she got this on uh, Amazon. I could see if... If she can send me a link uh, later, I'll add the link to the description. If you're interested in getting one of these, I'm definitely going to order one for my van. She keeps this in the vehicle, or her SUV, I should say, for removing dog hair off of the, the back section has that gray uh, automobile carpet. And there I'm sliding my booty back over my heel she's still working it gotta keep in mind I probably wouldn't have been down there trying to remove all the fuzz balls like she was <laughs> so it's a good thing she was with me she's definitely OCD when it comes to cleaning and this room this is one of the living rooms downstairs and I wanted to have my wife uh, show I'm using the the blue microfiber pad just to pre-scrub it doesn't have scrubbing strips but I don't really need them this is a a Berber flat Berber but look at the transition 
Let's see if she can get the proper angle. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Let me see. She's going to find the angle, but it's just stripping like butter. Oh yeah. And I did put a video up on, I think, a community post. It was a somebody else's TikTok, an ex-military guy from the 82nd uh, Airborne Unit. And he was showing how you how he figure eights his extension cords. Oh man, I'm telling you, if you haven't seen it, I know sometimes the community page or the post won't come up unless you subscribe. So you can click on my channel, view channel, and then click on the community page and check out that last post. It has been a lifesaver. Even my wife will testify because this is a pretty heavy, I think it's a 12 gauge cord, 50 foot. And if you watch how this gentleman, I guess that's how they used to uh, wind up their parachutes. And he was showing how he now uses that method, the figure eight method for his extension cords. Man, I'm not kidding you. I have been rolling all my cords so, so easy. You basically pull the two, you, you cut the cord in half, or don't cut it in half, you just kind of pull it all the way out and then you back up so that you got it 50%, so now it's 25 foot grab the end and then you use your two arms and you figure eight it and then slide the hoop through definitely check it out it's on my community page just click on view channel it's something that if you do a lot of extension cords or you have a machine like this or the swirly or the mighty eco or the Co even the coblentz uh, any machine where you can take the cord and separate it from the machine it is incredible so check it out and look at how nice this is coming out i mean i'm just going over it really slow showing off those fabulous gucci shoe booties <laughs> oh look at that they match the pad come on Polly c we styling we profiling <laughs> cleaning up these dirty carpets my goodness i will come back with a glad pad go over it one more time i don't think we feature that here so anyway i appreciate you watching another episode i'll show you a few of the rooms this was the room downstairs main family room came out absolutely beautiful and i'll end it here with a bucket full of dirty pads heading for the laundry room. <laughs> all right, I'll catch you all in the next episode. Thank you for watching.